hey guys i hope you are doing fine it's all going well for my side guys i want to show you how you can add custom domain for your firebase app that you just deployed in my case this is the project that i will be creating a custom domain for and um okay what you just need to do just go to the hosting option but in my case, this one is a shortcut. You can just go to build and then you'll find it here. Um, so th these are the domains that I already have for, for this project, but I want to add another one. In my case, it's going to be www.connectafrica.co.za, um, but here you can just type in the domain that you have then you click next it takes like a bit of time but it's quick enough so basically here you have two options that you can follow the setup mode the the, the quick setup and the advanced one i recommend to you you use the advanced one because you also get this you also get this log you also get the, the HTTPS certificate as well um basically what you just need to do from here you need to go to your hosting provider in my case let me just go to home in my case i'm using client client zone is basically one of like a south african uh company biggest hosting company in south africa so you go to the hosting using this to, if you are using this platform but it should be able you should be able to do this with both like hosting or do, domain providers so you just click your domain here and then you go to hosting settings then uh, you need to create the new dns record just gonna click this button like that and then in our case the domain that we want to create for is www.connectafrica.co.za but you can just write your domain here um you create this record this is the type that you want to use even if you check on firebase the type of these values is txt so what they want here is the type the content is basically this one this is just to verify that that domain belongs to you you do this and then the ttl here is basically the port number i think is 7200 then you create that it's created this takes up to 24 hours to be active but it could also take 10 minutes um just gonna do okay here um create another one because we also have this value here this one is specifically for the certificate so you do exactly the same you write the domain your domain here www so here you do create like txt this is what you want and the content here you just paste that still the same port 7200 and then you create it also takes up to 24 hours just like 10 10 minutes to 24 hours to be active um guys that's all from my side i uh, see you on my next vi video don't don't forget to subscribe but basically that's all you can just close the dialog like this when it's active on the, the status here it will change to connected thank you guys i really appreciate you for watching my video